What is the easiest way to blur a PDF bank statement? Hello, viewers. Today, we're going to address an important topic, how to blur out confidential information on a PDF bank statement. This could be important for various reasons such as privacy concerns or when submitting documents for verification processes where some information is not required. So, let's get started. What will you need? To successfully blur out information on a PDF document, you'll need two primary tools. One, a PDF reader. This can be any application that allows you to view and edit PDFs. Adobe Acrobat Reader DC is a popular option. Two, an image editor. This can be a simple and free tool like MS Paint or more sophisticated ones like Photoshop or GIMP. How to extract the information to be blurred? Firstly, we need to get the information that we want to blur into an image format that we can easily edit. Here's how. 1. Open your PDF bank statement with your preferred PDF reader. 2. Identify the area you want to blur and take a screenshot. This can typically be done with keyboard shortcuts, like print screen, button on Windows, Command plus Shift plus 4 on Mac. How to blur the extracted information? After obtaining the screenshot, the next step is to blur the confidential information. 1. Open the screenshot in your preferred image editor. 2. Select the blur tool in your image editor. This may be called different things in different editors, but it's usually clearly labeled. 3. Apply the blur tool to the area of the screenshot that contains the confidential information. How to reinsert the blurred information into the PDF? Finally, we need to put our blurred image back into the PDF document. 1. Save the edited screenshot as a new image file. 2. Go back to your PDF editor and import the blurred image, placing it exactly over the area you want to cover. And there you have it. You've now successfully blurred out confidential information on a PDF bank statement. Remember, this is not just for bank statements, but for any PDF document where you need to protect your personal information. Always respect and protect your privacy. I hope this video has been helpful. Stay safe, and thanks for watching.